Let's just see how good this uh, zoom is. Fifteen times, nineteen times zoom, twenty-four times, twenty-seven times, thirty-five times, forty-four times. Bear in mind this is also through glass. Forty-nine times, sixty-two times, seventy-two, seventy, eighty-four. Now 90 is what this should go to, but in fact, as I've got it set up slightly different, I can't remember how I did it now, but it will go on to 180. So a bit windy out there today. So we go now, we're on 130. I know it's not that great a quality, but look, it's 200 times zoom now. It would cost you a fortune to get that sort of quality of lens with an ordinary SLR camera, digital camera. That's up to 500 times, seven, 800 times. Then we're losing it, but that's 1700 times zoom, that last one. That's 3000 times zoom. So, as they used to say, it's not necessarily the quality, it's sometimes getting the best the most important picture and obviously you can film this and then edit it and pick up the different uh, frames and also from here you can also take uh, stills so that there is on that's on 68 percent that is on 90, 90 times is is what they uh, recommend the camera as its maximum. Intelligent zoom. Seems pretty intelligent to me. Certainly more intelligent than I am. Anyway, bear in mind as I say this is through glass. It's pretty good. And I'm just going to pan out now to the wide angle. You can see that's hardly visible from here, but that zoom brings it way, way in. So if you're interested in filming buildings or distant things that you want to sort of be able to see, this is a uh, good, uh, I've always been very pleased with this little camera, which is made by uh, Panasonic. And I'll put the name of it in the, uh, in the notes. There we go, there we go, back. No more bugs on there. Let's go across slightly with the old thing, don't make you too dizzy. You can see all the little spiky bits on the stems there, even the, the detail of that. See the black spot on the roses as well. <gasps> oh my goodness, don't worry about the black spot on the roses. Doesn't actually make any difference to the quality of the blooms, just looks a bit nasty. I haven't sprayed a rose against black spot for years. All my roses look pretty spectacular. <laughs>